Hey guys, this is Gene Jensen, and I want to talk about standing up in a kayak. Uh, you know, the kind of the ins and the outs, the do's and the don'ts. And and uh, the first of all, you can't stand up in just any kayak. It has to be a wide kayak that's got uh, that does not have a rounded bottom that's uh, pretty stable uh, when it rocks left and right. Best thing to do when you're picking out a kayak is to uh, is to see if you can find a place that sells them that you can get some seat time where you can go out and try them out. Try to stand up in them and everything else. Rule number one, don't stand up for the first time when the water's cold. <laughs> you fall in, you die. I mean, so uh, my suggestion would be don't try to stand up in a kayak until it's warm, uh, until the water's warm. So if you do fall in, it's okay. Take all your gear out and go out and practice. Um, another key thing is, uh, is just I, I have to have a seat. Personally, I have to have a seat that's above my feet. Um, if I don't have a seat that's above my feet, I just can't stand up. Uh, once again, it's about the fat boy thing. Uh, I just, you know, I'm 41 years old. It's hard for me to stand up. So this one is perfect for me. You want to get your feet as wide as you can. The PA-14, uh, my kayak's a mess. The PA-14 has got these uh, these uh, skid skid uh, pads right there to keep you from, from sliding around in the, in the kayak and make it to where you can stand up. But you want to have your feet as wide as you can in the kayak. Just get over top of them. And stand up okay now uh, a key thing is to remember is you have always got to keep your feet uh, wide and it's got to keep your feet wide as in the the uh, from left to right of the boat if you stand center line of the boat if you turn 90 degrees and I'm not gonna do it you will fall in so make sure that you always keep your feet and keep your body facing forward or backwards and it's hard to turn around backwards but the best thing to do is to sit down Turn around, get your lower your center of gravity back down to being low, and then turn around and uh, and then stand back up. I don't per I don't particularly like to do it. Sometimes I have to turn around to get in the box, but that's about it. So, um, but the key key thing is is you cannot have your body uh, per or uh, parallel to the center line. It's got to be perpendicular to the center line. So, um, be careful, be smart. Don't. Like I said, don't do this in cold weather um, for the first time. Get used to your kayak in the warm weather. Pick a wide kayak. Pick one that's got a seat um, uh, above the above your feet so you can stand up easier. It just makes things a lot safer. This is just that that's what I love about this hobby is this is the first kayak that I've been able to stand up in. And I, I grew up fishing out of a canoe, so I know what stable and unstable is, that's for sure. But anyway. Well, like I always say, be sure to introduce somebody to fishing. Be sure to, uh, to let me help you teach them how to fish. Just show them my videos and, and, uh, and you know, it's what I love to do. I absolutely love to do it. But anyway, be sure to, uh, to get out of the water, go out and catch some fish, and have a great day. Oh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed. I always forget to say that. Later.